Dallas Eakins and his Toronto Marlies getting set to tangle with the Hamilton Bulldogs. And a look at the diplomats of the Diamond Defos who will be in goal this afternoon. And it is Robert Mayer who is 4-4-1 thus far this season. And Ben Scrivens 3-4-0. A coin takes a bit of a stick in the face as he is back on his skates. Ranger with a drive. Backhand scores! Leo Komarov was right on the doorstep, and whether he got a piece of that as it was trickling to the goal line, we'll have to take another look at it. Well, Komarov had a ter terrific road trip. If he does get credit for this goal, it's his sixth goal, and this is what he does. He's right parked in front of the net. And he does an excellent job of providing a screen. Good re puck recovery here by the Marlies as they grab the puck back and get it down on the, the boards. And now Komarov will go right to the front of the net after a coin did a real nice job getting the puck and keeping it alive. Scott gets it ahead. Hamilton brings it across the line for the Marlies. The captain gets it into the corner around to North. Center for the goal! Jumping into the rush, Mark Fraser. Alexander Utzon, who has some potential as a player, has never been able to find his way for the Bulldogs. And Fraser, right in the middle of your ice, just goes right by him. And then ends up with the puck right in the slot, and he makes no mistake. A missed hit there, first of all, by Tenorti. And then Hamilton with a real good play to take the check. And then a nice little feed to Fraser, who scores very little his first goal so far this year. You know, when you talk about developmental leagues and rookie says a Scott scores Mayer got trapped out of the goal and the Marlies have jumped to a three nothing lead as Deshaw is gifted with a loose puck on the side and Mayer couldn't get back Gardner back in across the line once more he pulls up this time dishes to Ranger back to Gardner who had to quickly turn around and get into position a coin down low. Padre back to a coin. Rangers right on the doorstep. They score! And I think it's a coin that's going to end up with the goal here. A centering pass by Kadri. Now to a coin, and it goes off of Tenorti's foot after a coin, or a coin here with a centering pass. And right between the wickets of Robert Maris, he was sliding across, playing the Gardner play who was on the other sides. Ranger knocks it down. Here's that patience again as Komarov takes the puck along the boards and plays it back to the net. Kadri centers in front. Another shot scores! What a pair of quick hands from a coin. His first shot was blocked, but he was quick onto that loose puck again. Yeah, the Marlies have done a good job winning the battles, and Ranger with a good read here jumps down the boards from the point and then sticks his hand out as well and makes a good glove save to keep the puck alive, a little cycle down low, and everybody's puck chasing for the Bulldogs there, and that's why a coin is left wide open as both D-men go for the puck behind the net. Not a good idea, and then one thing about that goal for forwards, you stay with the shot. Launched in over the line by Ryan and down into the Hamilton zone. Ryan with a launching check, and now he's going to be engaged by Zach Startini. And Startini has his man down on the ice and is uh, getting in most of the shots. It wasn't that bad a hit, really, to be honest. I don't think he jumped. Let's have a look again. I mean, it's straight on. It's not on the numbers. And, uh, of course, Stortini didn't take too kindly to it. Down His team down by five goals, and that's what he does. And he'll be gone, I would expect, for the afternoon. They're going to give him seven minutes, five and two. We hope they'll find a way to get it done. Here's Scrivens giving the puck away, and he pays for it. Well, Ushai intercepted that at the blue line and snaps in the shorthanded goal. And it is 5-1. Here's Komarov in over the line for the Marlies. Still on the power play. That's the second shorthanded, may get the third shorthanded goal the Marlies have given up this season. The pass in front scores! A snapshot there from Koska. And the Marlies will at least equalize on this long power play that still has 59 seconds left in it. Let's go down to ice level. Well, we'd better. Joe Colburn's getting something started here with Gabriel Zumal. Whoa! Zumal tagged Colburn right on the 
puck. Colburn's the bigger player, but Zumon got that right hand. Free. Whoa, he got everything off. Shoulder pads, elbow pads. Oh, the whole kit and caboodle. And that'll be an additional penalty because the tie down wasn't on. Bringing it out now here is Nash hitting the line. He's hip checked to the boards. And they're going to play this one out right to the final buzzer. There's a good hit there by Ranger. And there's the end of the game. So the Marlies are welcomed home by a sellout crowd at the Rico Coliseum after an eight game road trip and they beat the Hamilton Bulldogs by a score of six to one.